Hello everyone, happy Wednesday. Uh, welcome to our weekly Praying Together. Uh, we are praying with you and for you, the community of Gethsemane. Uh, if you have a prayer request that you would like to be lifted up next week, please just leave a comment or send us a message and we'll be happy to add you to the list. Uh, this week our Praying Together is on the theme of thankfulness. Uh, and specifically, our thankfulness for community. Uh, this holiday is especially hard as we do our part to stop the spread of coronavirus. And for a lot of us, that means isolating and not being able to spend Thanksgiving with our families. But it's important to remember that this call to be separate this year is also tied to our faith uh, and our hope to do no harm as United Methodists. So please, join me as we pray. From the Book of Common Prayer. Accept, O Lord, our thanks and praise for all that you have done for us. We thank you for the splendor of the whole creation, for the wonder of life, and for the mystery of love. We thank you for the blessing of family and friends, and for the love, loving care which surrounds us on every side. We thank you for our successes, which satisfy and delight us, but also for the disappointments and failures that lead us to acknowledge our dependence on you alone. Above all, we thank you for your Son, Jesus Christ, for the truth of his word and the example of his life. We thank you for his dying, through which he overcame death, and for his rising to life again, and which we have raised to the life of your kingdom. Lord, may we, at all times and in all places, give thanks to you in all things. Lord, this week we offer gratitude. Thank you for all the ways that your love, grace, and acceptance shows up in our lives. We pray that as we try to be good stewards of our blessings, that we may also live out that same love, grace, and acceptance towards others. Lord, we also lift up our weekly prayer requests, both spoken and unspoken. Please be with those who weigh heavily on our hearts. Lord, we pray for our hospital staff once again. Uh, we pray for the patients, the doctors, the nurses, the janitors. Bring healing and safety into those spaces for everybody. Lord, we pray for mental health. Uh, be with people who are struggling with depression, feelings of being overwhelmed, or having suicidal thoughts, especially around the holiday. And Lord, we pray for everyone celebrating Thanksgiving in isolation. And even though we may physically be alone, we know that your presence is with every single person. Give them strength to pers persevere through this difficult holiday. Gracious God, we lift this prayer to you. 